Okay, I just use my makeup wipes to wipe away all my makeup. So today my face is bare Welcome to my channel. My name is Karen If this is your first time seeing my face, you guys are in for a treat You guys will be showering with me This is my shower ritual and I'll be taking you into a moment of zen Today, I want to thank Amika so much for partnering with me to make this video possible and I'll be doing a giveaway. In order to enter this giveaway, all you gotta do is give this video a thumbs up and drop any comment in the comment section below. You can tell me you had dim sum today. Your first car was a Honda. You can tell me literally anything, anything. I have three dogs. So these are just really random facts about me. My first car was actually a Honda. It was a Honda Prelude. This is what you'll be winning today. These two Amika products and they are perfect for the shower and after the shower. This is an amazing nourishing mask for your hair. And then this guy is the Volt Leave-In Lock-In Conditioner. So once again, all you gotta do to enter this giveaway is to give this video a thumbs up and leave any comment you want as many times you want and this will be an international giveaway. I promised in my last video that I'm going to tell you guys the winner for the last video in this video. I went on commentpicker.com and randomly picked a winner. Dun, 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 dun. The winner is Emily Yan. So if you are Emily Yan, make sure you DM me on Instagram at I'm Karen o. I will be getting your information to send your gift up to you. Congratulations. Without further ado, let's jump right into my shower routine. I'm calling this my shower ritual because this is my safe space where I can just focus on self-nurturing my body. If your current environment allows you to, I'd like to invite you to join me interactively and just take the next five minutes in practicing mindfulness. As I turn on the water, I like to take this time to experience gratitude. I think that functioning hot water is underrated and in a shower is such a beautiful thing. I also like to be aware of how the water is hitting my body with intention and without judgment. This girl gets a lot of buildup on my hair because I don't wash my hair every day. I like to just keep the natural oils on my hair roots and keep my hair nice and shiny, but this means massive buildup. So I like using this charcoal cleansing oil pre-shampoo and I like to sit here, rub the product in, create as much bubbles as I can and allow that minty freshness feeling just penetrate onto my scalp so that it feels cleansed and renewed. Now I'm just rinsing the suds from my hair. I really like to take this time to feel every drop that is hitting my scalp and washing away the buildup. You know how when you were a kid and you'd imagine different shapes or textures you're creating in the shower? Well, my shampoo is a jelly exfoliating shampoo. And I love how I feel like I'm creating a jelly texture on my hand. And just feel that and rub that together to create soap suds all over my hair. It's like I'm creating a space for creativity and openness while I'm taking care of myself at the same time. My hair only looks healthy, but when you touch it, it's super dry and brittle. And that's really because I've been dying and bleaching it the last three years of my life. You guys, this hair mask is a must in my routine because of that. And I've been using Amika's The Cure Intense Mask. This product has just really helped in softening and strengthening my hair back into health. As you guys can tell, the consistency is super soft and buttery. And I really just love smoothing it on my palm and slowly applying it to my hair. I leave my hair mask on for about five minutes. And meanwhile, I start washing my face. I'm not even exaggerating, but I've been through around five bottles of this cleanser. 
my skin is very dry so I always gravitate towards formulas that's hydrating like this one I like to take my time and form soap suds especially around my nose and t-zone area because I tend to build sebum around that area I think there's two types of people those who brush their teeth in the shower and those who do it by the sink I personally find it most relaxing to do this in the shower and I'm a bit of a toothpaste snob. I have been using Crest's Glamorous White Toothpaste with my Sonicare Diamond Clean Toothbrush for almost 8 years. This combination is my key secret to my white pearly teeth and it's really the reason why I rarely ever need to wipe my teeth for my bright smile. major sucker for anything rose scented. That's why whenever I see Crabtree and Evelyn's rose water scent at TG Maxx. Yes, I am a bargain buyer and this is definitely my go-to. I always buy about two to three bottles of this good stuff. We're here at the last step and this is the time where I rinse out the hair mask. As we're in the last moments of my shower routine, I just want to thank the water for cleansing and relaxing me. I really hope this video helped inspire you to love and pamper yourself in your own shower routine. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!